Let me show you how I color correct my videos in Camtasia. Hey everyone, how's it going? It's Jewel Tolentino here from Essatino Media showing you how to create profitable content. All right, so in this video, I'm gonna show you how I do an advanced color correction technique in Camtasia 2021. All right, so you do need the Camtasia 2021 version to do this because we are going to be using two color correcting type features and I'll show you in just a second. So I've got some raw footage here right now. And this is footage from our DSLR camera, the Canon M50. Now I will say that if you fix the lighting beforehand, it's going to make your color correcting process easier and it's going to look better. Okay, so I've got some test footage right here and this has not been color corrected yet. And as you can see, it's pretty good. I do have a light on this side of my business partner, Arit. It's an umbrella light and it was shining on her from this side. So this is what I do for the advanced color correcting method. I use two tools. So they're in my favorites because I've favorited them and make sure you guys are using that. So I use these two right here the color LUT and color adjustment. If you don't know what a color LUT is or how to get more of them or how to use them, check out my other tutorial down in the description. I did one dedicated to color LUTs and how to install them into your Camtasia for free. They do give you one color LUT in this feature, but if you want more, and I do suggest that you get more, watch that video and then come back here. So here's how I use the two features. So first I'm going to drag the color LUT down and you can see already that it's changed the image. So it's going to go on to the default one, which is called enhance contrast. Like I said, I do have some other ones as well that are installed that were totally free, but for the purposes of this video, we'll use the enhance contrast because I do actually like to enhance the contrast in my videos and images. You can see that it made the darks quite dark. And if I turn it off, you can actually see that the image was, was kind of more faded, right? Less color to it. Whereas this, it made it more intense. Now it's a little too intense. So what I would do is I would actually lower the intensity down about this much and the whole thing is just playing around with it right moving things up and down and at the end of the day you want to get it to your liking right so if i turn off the color let you'll see that things are a little bit more grayed out right you can see the difference here you can see it more so as a whole on the image rather than arit's skin tone you can see that it affects the painting the couch less so on her actual skin tone. After I put the color LUT, I then go over to color adjustment, which is also in my favorites. And if you can't find this stuff, if you don't have favorites, just click on the more tab, head over to visual effects, and you'll find the color LUT and color adjustment in the visual effects tab. So head back over to favorites, and I'm gonna drag color adjustment down. It's gonna be a shock because it's gonna make it very intense and black and white. That's okay, that's the default of, of color adjustment. And we're gonna play around with the different brightness, contrast, and saturation. So what I typically do is I bring this down, the contrast, I bring the saturation up, which gives it the color, and then I'm gonna bring down the brightness, And maybe just a little bit more of the saturation because Arit's skin was looking really pink. <laughs> I'll break it down just a little bit here. And you can see here that, in my opinion, I, I'm thinking it's looking pretty good. So if I turn off everything, let's turn off the color adjustment. And then turn off the color LUT. And this was the original raw. Like I said, the original raw wasn't too bad because it was lit properly to begin with. 
I had some direct sunlight, an umbrella light, but with these enhancements, the color LUT and the color adjustment, it definitely brings out more energy to the video. So that's how I use the color LUT and the color adjustment. It takes some tweaking around and playing around with. All you're doing is playing around with these knobs. So if you found this video helpful, I have a nine plus hour 70 lecture Camtasia course that will fast track your Camtasia learning. If you want to learn Camtasia fast, I highly recommend you take this course. All right, so that is my advanced color correcting tutorial in Camtasia 2021. Do this on your videos and enhance the color. If this video was helpful, give me a thumbs up and I'll see you in the next video.